my loves, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it's gonna be my makeup vanity tour. And this is my vanity. It's actually a desk from Target. I'll link it down below for you guys. So it's just a white desk and it comes with three drawers. So originally the handles of the drawers were like a chrome silver color and I wanted them to be gold so I spray painted them. This is like a rustic gold and I think they just look better. My vanity mirror is a DIY. There's so many videos that you guys can watch on YouTube how to make this. So basically my mirror, it is from Ikea and the lights I believe are from Home Depot. I also purchased a connection that you connect and you have this remote control where you could turn on the lights and turn them off instead of plugging them in and plug them out. As I have those ugly cables under my desk, I know they don't look cute, but I need them that way I could use this remote control. Okay, so I'm going to start showing you guys from the top what I have. I do have quite a lot of stuff in my vanity, so I'm not going to go in detail with everything. I have these beautiful flowers. They are real. I am going to be probably drying them out, and then hopefully they'll look nice, and I'll keep them here. In the bottom, I have this tray. It is a mirror tray, and this one, I got it from Amazon. It's really pretty. It's not the best quality. It does feel kind of cheap, but it looks nice. In this tray, basically, I have all my perfumes here. I'm just not going to go in detail with my perfumes because... You guys can see which ones I have. They are all presents that I have ever got except this one. I did buy this one which is a Prada one. I am not big on perfumes. I usually use like the Victoria's Secret body sprays. But lately I've been getting into using perfumes and I really like them. We have my lipsticks right here which I think they just look really cute in the core. And then I have some jewelry there. In the back I just have my little small Dior bag where I have some Dior earrings that I got for my birthday. Moving on, I have two little trays. They are from Goodwill and I just have some jewelry here. And then on this one, usually I have like my scrunchies and like hair stuff, hair ties, things like that. These two glass gold trays are from Probably home goods. I'm pretty sure they're from home goods, either that or Marshalls. I forgot what I got them. I wanted my tones to be basically gold and white, and that's why I have a lot of gold details. So, on this one in the front, it's kind of like decor items that I wanted to put, not mainly what I use my everyday. So, these are like my Chanel lipsticks, my Tom Four YSLs, and I do have a foundation that I do use sometimes, which is the fit me foundation i do like that one this one is more for like decor this is my ysl foundation i used to love this foundation so much but it actually started breaking me out so i stopped using it but it just looks really beautiful like in the front right there it just looks really nice and then in the back i just have like my fits plus i do have this little sample of a perfume that i got for christmas and yeah basically just my fits plus and this is like my everyday foundation that i always use my naked skin when i do put foundation on usually i use this one for my everyday now moving on to the second one so this one is a little bit different so this one has two compartments here and then this is supposed to be one big compartment so as you guys can see let me take this out so it's supposed to be like that there's nothing there. But I wanted to put my brushes here. So I just used this pencil clear container to put my brushes. And I just think like that it looks really nice. These are my everyday brushes that I use. So that's why it's, I don't have a lot of brushes here. So I do just have a, a couple of just face brushes. Like foundation, bronzer, highlighter, blush. And yeah, like if I want to do like cream contour, stuff like that. Also in the front, I just basically have like my luxury, you know, bougie highlighters, whatnot, that are expensive. So this one is from Bobbi Brown. It is so pretty. It was a limited edition one. So yeah, so that's where I put like just this, mainly as the core. I honestly do not use that as my everyday, but I just think it looks really pretty. This one's really nice. This one's from Chanel. This one is also a limited edition one. It's really, really pretty. It's like a flower. The last thing that I have on top of my desk, 
This one is a jewelry boss and this one I guess is supposed to be like for your makeup. And let me just show you guys what I have in there. So for my jewelry bonds, I don't have jewelry in there. I basically have like all my hair pieces that I use because, you know, now lately everyone's using like, let me just open it. You know, the hair clips and stuff like that. The ones with the pearls. So that's where I put all of my hair pieces that I want to use like for a picture or like an everyday these are so cute and I got all of them from Amazon I really like how they look let me just like show you guys right here they're so pretty and I just think they look so cute in this clear box and I'm pretty sure this is also from home goods and this one as well because they mainly buy everything from home goods this one's acrylic just have like all my nudes here I like using mainly nudes now and I just have like a couple of glosses and some lipsticks from either Anastasia, Beverly Hills, or MAC, or Kylie Cosmetics. I really like the ones from Kylie Cosmetics. And I just have like a lip pencil that I like to use. And then on this one, I really don't know yet what to put on here. So right now, I just have my concealers and then I just have to um this one's an eyeshadow from chanel and this one is a blush from nars so i just put that in here but i don't know exactly what i'm gonna put there yet so that's mainly what i have on the top of my vanity it does seem like i have a lot of stuff but i still have a lot of space to do my makeup i forgot to show you guys this so i do have a coaster and i just put this one is from probably from ross and marshall's I just have a coaster here just because, you know, sometimes I'm drinking something and I could just put my drink there and it's not going to damage my desk. So now I'm going to show you guys what I have in the drawers. Basically, everything that I have in my drawers are what I use every day when I do my makeup. So this is our drawers and honestly what I don't like is that you guys see like this is all it opens. There's so much more space in the back. But it just won't open more, which sucks, but it is what it is. So on the first drawer, what I have, I have this clear container. But what I like is that it has like little slots and it just works perfect. I think I got it from like the dollar store. And the first one, I have my pomades from ABH, which I do have two. And then I have a gel eyeliner when I do want to do eyeliner. And then I just have my sponge, which... It's kind of dirty right now. And then I have my Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. I really like this powder. I always use this powder. I actually have a mini one. And then this is where I put my eyelashes. I usually don't wear eyelashes like in everyday makeup. But I just have them there just in case if I do want to wear some eyelashes. So these are some of my favorite lashes. The Style Selena. I'll just leave a link below because I do have a discount code for you guys. If you guys want to save some money. I really like these eyelashes. This is a new pair that I got. I have like the old one somewhere here and then just have a couple more lashes. Which this one is the smallest drawer that this desk comes with. So now let's move on to the big drawer. Also like the other one it does not open all the way. This is just as much as it opens. There's still like a lot of space behind here. I think there's like this much more space behind there which sucks because I could really put more stuff in there but it is what it is so this little divider container I got this one from I believe Marshall's um, I like how it's pink now I'm kind of regretting it I don't know if I like the pink maybe I should have got a white one but I think this is cute and I like that it has the little dividers I wish it had like maybe another one here as you guys could see I put this little thing <laughs> which it doesn't really work just to make another divider there but this is basically what i do use like my everyday makeup is this so we'll start with the back so in the back i just have my face powders which are from mac oh actually this is my bronzer and then this one i think these are bronzers yeah these are bronzers this one is when i do have a tan and it's a face powder but this one is a bronzer and i just have those there and then here I have my Hula bronzer because I love, love this bronzer to contour my nose. And then this is my favorite highlighter. This is the one that I use every day, which is the Amrisi highlighter. I really, really love this color. 
And then the other highlighter that I like to use is this one from... This one's the Mary, Mary Luminizer from The Balm. It's also really nice. It's lighter than Amrisi, so this one is a little bit more brighter. So it just depends, like, if I want to have, like, a stream highlighter, then I use this one. If not, then I'll just use the Amrisi one. Sometimes I do combine them together because I like how that looks. And this is one of my favorite blushes besides the one from NARS. This is also from MAC. And this one is in the shade Spring Sheen. It's really cute. And these are my face powders. So they're just basically regular powder. So over here, I don't have much. I just have two mascaras, which are my favorite mascaras. This one is from Essence. This one's really good mascara and it's only like three bucks. And this one is from Tarte, the Lights Camera Flashes. And then if I do want to contour my face with cream, I have my favorite contour stick, which is from Bobbi Brown. You guys already know I love this contour stick, so I have to keep this here. I have a little primer. Sometimes I do prime my face, not always, so I just have like a little one because, like I mentioned, I usually don't use a primer. And then my favorite foundations for an everyday, if it's not the one from Urban Decay, the Naked Skin, then it's this one. This one's my favorite foundation. A lot of people, when I wear this one, they always tell me, like, my skin looks so flawless. It looks mad, but it doesn't look, like, you know, drying on the skin. And they always tell me, like, what are you wearing? Like, they think, like, I'm wearing, like, a really expensive foundation. But no, guys, it's this one. And then here is just, like... You know, the little things, eyelash curl, little scissors, and tweezers, sharpener. These are for my pomades, so if they are feeling kind of dry, then I just put a little drops of this, and it works well. And I just have this glitter eyeliner, just if, you know, I want to put some glitter. This is one of my favorites from Mirvin Decay. I don't have a lot of palettes here because I'm going more for like the natural look so I don't need a lot of palettes. So when it comes to palettes, I don't have a lot of palettes because this is more, I usually always do like a more natural makeup look. So the only palettes I have right here is this one from Morphe and this is mainly basically for my eyebrows if I want to do like a more natural eyebrow. And then this one is a customized palette that I made. So it's just a C palette and most of the eyeshadows are either from MAC or Anastasia Beverly Hills. And then I just have two blushes and a contour um, powder. But as you guys can see, they're all neutral colors. Just have a couple little pop of color just in case if I want to use like a little bit darker mauve shades. In the back, I just have my Naked Heat palette and it just has like all the basically neutral colors. I also like to use these, these colors. So that's why I have this in here. So that's all I have in this drawer. Moving on to the last drawer. This again is the little one. <laughs> so I just have my white bees from Elf. And then I have this contour palette from Abon D. If you guys been following me for a long time, you guys know this is one of my favorite palettes, as you guys could see. And I also have this palette. Just because since my hair right now, it is peach. I like to use these shades because they are like the perfect peachy shades. So lately I've been using especially like these two. I really like how that looks. So I just keep this palette here plus it smells so good. And that's everything I have guys in my desk. I know it looks like I have a lot of stuff. Some of it just for the core. I just wanted to look pretty. And mainly what I have in my drawers is everything I use like an everyday makeup look. But if you guys like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And let me know in the comments down below what do you guys thought about my vanity tour. And if you guys want to know where I got certain items that I didn't mention, let me know also down below and I'll try to link it down for you guys. You guys see Belle in the background? She's like, what are you doing? <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye my loves.